So Madam Web, it came out on Valentine's Day. Uh, real quick, Joey, how, how was your Valentine's Day? Did you have a good one? Oh, very manly, man. I had lots yeah. of dates and lots of <clears throat> stuff. And oh, hung out with my mom that's, and stuff. That's cool. How about the rest of you? You guys had good Valentine's Days? It was awesome. Yeah, Loved it. Very, really good. Very good Valentine's oh, that's great. Day. I had yeah. a great Valentine's oh Day with my husband. <laughs> Ooh, I, um, I'm, I'm I didn't. Pull, yeah, well, I didn't pull my neck making out with the dune popcorn bucket. Wait, that's that's not why my neck's broken. But yeah, my oh. Valentine's Day was me alone in the theater with the dune popcorn bucket, watching Adam, Adam Webb, and I you was alone? like. Yes. With your um, popcorn bucket, your dude popcorn bucket. <laughs> no, <Yes>. no, ew. <laughs> so you sorry. alone with your wormhole? Ew. The funny thing was when I bought my tickets, there were supposed to be five people in the theater. The two people in the front row, they never showed up. They were like, oh, fuck it. We're not going to Madam Web. Um, and I will say, compared to the last few Valentine's Days, not the worst. Uh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> just, I had worse Valentine's Days. You're so sad, Tony. <laughs> I'm so sorry. So sad. We're, getting, we're getting better, guys. Don't worry. We're getting, I'm in the gym five days a week. We're getting better. Um, so, yeah. They announced that this was going to be another Sony Spider-Man spin-off, part of their Spider-Verse movies, Thank which the only money. two that do well are Venom and the animated ones. That's it. Morbius sucked, and they decided to go ahead with fucking Madam Web and Craven. Uh, Just make it worse. Why huh? Not? Just make it worse. Why not? Yeah, why not? Just make it uh, worse. And you know what? When I first like heard like what the movie was going to be, I'm like, you know what? Maybe there's some potential there. It's an alternate universe. Tony, you, got... you I, I no, don't. No, no, no. Before no, no, I no. saw it, I'm like, no, okay, no, you got... no, 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 no. Just in ter- when this was announced and I saw the cast. Yeah. That's all I needed. <laughs> it's a good. Are cast. you kidding me? I don't care about the script. I'm not looking at the script. You know what? You're right. You're right. When we heard that Dakota uh, Johnson was playing Madam Web, we all went perfect. They nailed it. Looks just like her. <laughs> yeah. They totally yeah, nice. they, yeah. they, they nailed it. Of Fifty Shades of Grey. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, so <laughs> here's my knowledge of Madam Web. Sometimes she showed up in the cartoon and I went, who is that lady? I don't care. <laughs> so that was all my knowledge of Madam Webb going That's into this. That's all my knowledge of Dakota Johnson, to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> um, Honestly, apparently, yeah. I guess to get around this, apparently there are new versions of the character where she is younger. Mm-hmm. I guess they use that to justify yeah, it. But I'm like, but... And I'm like, but this is the more popular version, the old lady who pops up out of nowhere. She's not even old! In the comics, she is. Okay, but this is not old. No, if, yeah, the joke is that they hired a girl who looks nothing like to, uh, Madam Web. That's the joke I'm going here with Johanna. <laughs> right. They thought, oh, oh wait, the joke movies. No one else got yeah. it. Everybody okay. else superhero like, movies yeah, is watched totally. by little boys. <laughs> and they're yeah. Bored. yeah, yeah. Um, gonna, not okay, okay, Joanna, Joanna, be quiet, be quiet before I put you <laughs> no. in the tunnel. Um, <laughs> let's, just, let's just go down the list here. Joey, how did you feel about Madam Web? Well, Tony, I went on a date for this movie, and oh! uh, needless to say, With I the have popcorn a, bucket. I no, she had a name. Uh, oh, okay. I can't remember, but I haven't she? talked to her since. I, uh, anyways, I got a bone to pick with this movie because this movie left little to be desired, right? This this movie might tickle the fancy of a preteen, but it it falls pretty flat. And there were a few times that I giggled, right? And it might have been for other reasons, but it was mostly <laughs> at the horrible writing. And, and I feel like they over-explained it. Everything in this movie, I was being spoon-fed. And I don't like being spoon-fed unless she's wearing fishnets. And it's just, <laughs> I hate this movie. This is horrible. I had a terrible time. Oh uh, <laughs> Ashton, how, how did you feel about, as the, oh no, I guess Joe had it. Finally, God. we got two women who watched the movie. Uh, Ashton, how did you feel about Madam Webb? Um, I was not expecting anything good from it. I know that Marvel has been kind of a down spiral. Uh, oh, this isn't even Marvel. This now. is this is Marvel and Sony. This is separate. I mean, either way, it's Marvel. It's something Marvel happened, okay? Mm. And I went in without really much to expect, and I went with a group of people who have been kind of defending Marvel for a few years now, kind of in denial, like, oh, She-Hulk wasn't that bad. Everything's mm. fine. Captain Marvel's great. And we all walked out of that movie theater, and it was very clear that even they could not 
sit through this. Like, it was that bad. Where the people who have defended She-Hulk and Captain Marvel are like, we, we can't defend this. I'm sorry. This is so You know what? So I, didn't, I, I mean, I saw Captain Marvel one, but I didn't watch She-Hulk. So maybe that's why I didn't hate it as much. Um, Sarah and Crystal, they, they said, no, we're not watching this movie. No, you told uh, me it was worse than Morbius. And I was like, oh, cool. No, no, yeah, no. I said Morbius was worse than this. I said this wasn't as bad as Morbius. It's still mm, other I people. No, no, I think Crystal, you told me the opposite. Crystal, Crystal. Crystal. Yes, my watch, love. Watch the movie. <laughs> okay. No, Adam, this was bad than Morbius. Okay. Morbius. Watch like, the way worse. Okay. Adam, how do you feel about Madam Webb? Uh, Crystal, as a voice of the people like you and I are, <laughs> I actually didn't have a problem with this. I, I put it on in the theater. I went bowling during the movie. <laughs> I went home, made some pizza, came back, and it was basically over. And I was like, not a bad time at the movies. Uh, this is this is a literal cancer. The film is, uh, I, call it, I, I call it Pepsi Web because most of the movie took place in the Pe Pepsi cinematic universe. Oh, you know why, right? Pepsi billboard. Well, I imagine because they had to deal with Pepsi, right? No, Pepsi. I think Pepsi owns Sony. That's why so many of their movies have Pepsi products. Really? Pepsi owns Sony? I think Pepsi this owns is, Sony. Yeah. Sony owns Pepsi, what? not Pepsi this owns Sony. Oh, no, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. I'm literally Googling it right now. What kind of deep soda state shit is this, Tony? I don't Pepsi think Pepsi owns is Sony. worth Yeah, more than list Sony. of assets owned by PepsiCo. Uh... Sony is one of them. <laughs> what? Yeah. Do I have to drink Pepsi now? They own yeah. everything. I don't want Pepsi. to. Yeah. Um, wow. Okay. Does Pepsi own me. <laughs> <laughs> you oh. are on the list. Yeah. It would be funny oh if Coke. God. It would be. It'd be really funny if Coca Cola owns I'm Disney. Just like I, I like, drink like Pepsi soda. Disney. Yeah, soda owns all the major studios. <laughs> <laughs> Mickey's gonna be slamming a tab in the next film. <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh my god. Yeah. So they're like together. And that's why there's like a but that's why when you saw Adam Sandler movies, they all had Pepsi cups that were all showing the logo to the screen. Um oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and yeah, I guess they were like, oh shit, this movie kind of sucks. Let's put a bunch of our Pepsi branding in it. Um yeah, Madam so Webb. What do you uh, really feel about the film, other than making fun a, of it? It's an embarrassment. We knew it was going to be though. This is the people that made Venom one and two, which Venom's passable at best. Uh, Venom two, let there be garbage, is horrible. <laughs> yeah, Venom two is fun. I enjoy Venom it, two. You're an idiot. Mor <laughs> Morbius is god awful bad. Uh, no, that I agree. That's the dude who got canceled from fucking Rotten Tomatoes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, you don't really. You're not really in a position to point this. <laughs> listen, Joanna. I'm listen, Jonah. Jonah Hill. <laughs> I'm still on Rotten Tomatoes, making a name over there. <laughs> You, Adam, you, really, you, you, you really, you really should no, have you don't want to Adam like five stars, but like it's perfect. They nailed it. Uh, Johanna, you actually saw this movie? No, I actually didn't. <laughs> why are, why are you stop pause, being pause, this? Pause, pause, pause. <laughs> so, I, I have multiple things to say about it, though. Right? Okay. So all the clips that I've seen via TikTok or just YouTube, whatever of these, just like like I I, I know exactly what happens at the end. Like okay. I I know what happens. This movie is right up my alley. Number one, everybody's <laughs> fucking hot as shit. Okay, it's Everybody, they have a nice cast. So Joanna, so dude, hot. So okay, similar. they are. Jo jo so Joanna, you're good. Uh, so hot. Like Sydney Sweeney, I want to bury my face. <laughs> In her boobs. Grimace but they cover boobs. them up the whole movie. Yeah, okay. Johanna, you, you're not wrong. I don't wrong. need to watch her this movie for her boobs. There's multiple other movies where I can see her bare breasts. Like, but, I don't but need this that. Movie is gonna give you that. But, but she's so hot as hell. I'll give That's, you that. But I would prefer okay, okay. to... But also, the delivery for some of these lines... Yes. I swear the they room. realize this is not a Marvel movie. This is a Sony movie. We're not going to be in some big thing. We're going to just tease this up. And it's the funniest deliveries I have ever heard. Probably since maybe like The Room. <laughs> you know who nailed like it? Like I said, it's like, giving The Room. So, yeah, Wait. some of these are so 
funny. I don't know how some of you are like, oh, this is actually kind of charming because Listen. this is so funny. They know it's bad. Have you seen the interviews for some of these? Oh, yeah. Dakota Johnson's They're interview. They're ripping this movie apart. They know. I swear they know. Dude, during the Dakota Johnson movie didn't know what the Spider-Verse this. was. They tried to explain the Spider-Verse for her. And she's like, no, it's not in the Spider-Verse. And they're yes! like, wait. <laughs> Well, I just think that has nothing to do with that. They're like, no, but there's like different universe. She had no idea what they were talking about. Um, uh, I, I what I think Johnson, happened was, uh, like a lot of these agent? films, they get rewritten. So oh. I, there's scenes early on where Dakota Johnson's like doing an okay job, and then there's other scenes where you could tell she checked out. The person who nailed it the most was Justin Wang when that clip of them talking to each other awkwardly came out. He was like, cast them all in an accurate Resident Evil adaptation right now. Because it sounded like PlayStation <laughs> 1 voice acting. Like, that scene, she's like, you were super awkward to me. And Dakota Johnson's like, that does sound like me. It, it felt like I was watching Resident Evil 1, like the game. Like, you were almost a Jill scene. Sandwich. <laughs> I felt the ending scene. I, I'm assuming no one cares sandwich. about spoilers. Yeah. D d does anybody care about spoilers? Uh, no, the ending know. is nonsensical. So clearly, clearly. she's blind. Oh no! Oh, oh my! No, that's I was a literally just... what? Number one. <laughs> so <laughs> funny. Looking out the window. She's Johanna, did you have a brownie what? before she's this? Looking out the window. Johanna, did you have a brownie before you came on? Uh, I made a have something else but it's fine i am drug testing everyone <laughs> from now on for the goddamn live episodes so we're all I'm, fucked i'm Joey's an adult, <laughs> I'm an adult hey man I'm leave an me adult out of this man <laughs> anyway okay, okay, uh, okay, okay, okay. i think Lisa, myself wait. johanna sarah Joey, wait, wait, wait. All right, listen, 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 listen. <laughs> listen back to the movie well, we've been talking about all the women. Let's talk about the men here. The the, no, the great stop. villain. I want to talk about the end scene of Madame Webb. Oh my God! Go do it. Do it. Do it now. Why do they have a blind woman facing the window? Because she's using her power. Funny. She's not looking at the actual window. She's looking, she's looking into, out the window. She's looking into recycled <laughs> footage from Spider Man Two. That was like a real thing. They recycled footage from Spider Man Two. All right. So Ezekiel <laughs> Sims. Everyone's favorite Spider-Man character. Joey, what's your favorite Ezekiel Sins moment from the comic? Uh, the one on page four, man. Uh, well, I, you don't sound like a real fan. Ashton, I bet you have like an Ezekiel Sims tattoo. What's your favorite thing about this character? Who? Okay, Sarah, you, you probably, you haven't seen this yet, but you're probably thrilled that Ezekiel Sims finally made it into a movie, right? Yeah. Woo. <laughs> Crystal. <That's funny. laughs> You're going to cosplay as Ezekiel Sims at the next yeah. convention, right? Oh, I have it already. Yeah, ready for it. Adam, being a little kid loving Spider-Man, how, how did you feel when Ezekiel Sims came up onto the screen? <laughs> confused. I'm really confused. <laughs> Is he, does he have Spider-Man powers? Because all he did was climb on... <laughs> two sides of buildings and jump high and that was it doesn't shoot yeah, a web. so in this movie apparently in peru there's just a tribe that has spider-man powers because they have different powers spiders. though different powers different powers yeah um so in the comics he doesn't have the spider suit they gave him this but they decided they're like hey you know let's be accurate let's actually have him in his uh his shoeless form yeah. but they never explain why he's running around barefoot and i don't know shit about the character because he's not a popular character so I don't know even the comic book reasoning why. Also, how does he switch into his suit? I It doesn't look like he's wearing it. The whole movie, he's switching in and out of his suit. That's what I weird. think was they filmed with this to look like the comics. And then they went, oh, this sucks. Give him a Spider-Man suit. And then they just use scenes from both versions. Because he's that one yeah. scene where he's talking to Madam Web and it's like a dream sequence. He's switching between the spider suit and his regular outfit. It's so fucking terrible. He's one of the worst comic book villains <laughs> I, I, in a movie I, I've ever seen. I found it more comical that they had 20-somethings. I think Sydney Sweeney's 26 or 27, yeah. and they're supposed to be playing high schoolers. So they're like, oh, God, how do we yeah. hide How do we hide the guns on Sydney Sweeney? So they're just like <laughs> her in like giant baggy sweatshirts <laughs> instead, of just it just, instead of just casting someone that was like closer to high school. Well, I think, I think they started the filming this. Cannons. I think they started filming this like two years ago before she really blew up in popularity or else she would have been like a big part. Yeah, blew up in popularity. Also, uh, it's also <laughs> oh, hilarious that. 
Dakota Johnson supposed to be the motherly figure, and she's only like seven years, six years older than most I of the know. cast. <laughs> like, come on, the old hag, take us in the car. But, but it guys, seems like they just underaged everyone. Like it's almost like yeah. just not, not even just like the whole joke about how you know how Spider Man's <laughs> aunt is super young in the new ones, but like they basically like you know what? Let's just make everyone look. 10, 20 years younger than they're supposed to be yeah. because yeah. clearly we have to get the male's audience attention by giving them pretty girls. Mm -hmm. So we have to get Dakota Johnson instead and of Johanna. More than they anyone. Had my yeah. Hey, it, it works for me. I, you know, this, this actress on the left is blaming men for not seeing this movie. And I uh, want you to know, lady, I was in the theaters day one with the Dune popcorn bucket <laughs> watching your movie. So don't group me in with the rest Ew. of those guys. Is that a joke? I was alone on Tony. Valentine's Tony. Day Tony. watching your shitty yeah. act. Tony, Tony, <laughs> yeah? is that a joke? Because uh, I've been, I've seen that that's actually not true. She didn't say anything. It's what, there's some website that. What? Makes, that, yeah, there's some website that actually just makes up shit. And then God there's damn no, it, like, I fell yeah. for that? Yeah, you fell for it. There's no actual proof that she said any of that. And oh, I think it was marketed towards men, if anything. Yeah, she, I feel like it was so yeah. overly marketed towards men because... Oh, it really was. It, it really was. Like, I well, don't know. And it just... It was marketed yeah. to no one. It well, was that, awful. No one saw it. They're only in this as dreams or like visions of the future. They're only in these outfits for like a second, which I guess yeah. was always the plan. But they were like, fuck, put all that in the advertisements. Put them all in the, okay. in the comic accurate suits. And trick people into thinking there's going to be a big finale at the end. Yeah, I do very much like that Sydney Sweeney was like, "No, put me upside down because my character goes upside down." But then, but then they had frantic editing, so you couldn't even see it. Uh, I don't care, guys. Did you like in the movie where Dakota Johnson said, "Hold on, I'll be right back. I have to go to Peru for thirty minutes." No, what was the other <laughs> thing? Like, uh, he he studied the spiders in the Amazon with my mother before she died. That wasn't in the movie. <laughs> That line yeah, never even made it into the know, movie. I know, I know, I know. Um, what, to Tony's point, though, what is in the movie is Dakota Johnson gets in a taxi cab and just drives to Peru from downtown New York, and then she drives back. That's no, expensive. I don't think. I think she. I think just when she comes back, Uber. we're in the stolen taxi cab, and she <laughs> still was Uber. driving in it. Um, <laughs> the Uber fare must be insane, man. To get no, down to Peru, like how does she afford that? Uh, so they put the movie in two thousand three. So yeah. I guess that was their way of being like, if this is good, we could say it's the Tom Holland Spider-Man, but well, no, that didn't no, work. you you saw the thing that they added in there, right? What? Where they kind of alluded to the, the um, original. <laughs> uh, oh my god, freaking! Oh my god, they're not the original or the yeah, Sam yeah. Raimi Spider-Man, yeah, yeah, uh, but that doesn't make sense because Peter None Parker. None of it does. <laughs> None of it does, Tony. <laughs> so apparently the original script was all about Ezekiel Sims trying to stop uh, Peter Parker from being born. Because Emma Roberts is Mary Parker in this, Spider-Man's mom. Yeah, I know. And that was going to be the whole script, and these girls were going to, like, help. And then they only made that, like, a little bit of the third. That should have been the whole third act, was them trying to protect her until Spider-Man was born. Instead, they do that for 20 minutes, and then they go, okay, let's go fight at the Pepsi factory with all the fireworks. I'm I like, like that baby fuck? shower scene, by the way. Oh, God, she was... That was so... That was so cringe. That That's a me thing, a very word vomit, like, oh, fuck, wait, oops. They're all trying to have fun, and she's all like, my mom abandoned... Or my mom oh. uh, traveled to Peru and then died, and I resent her. She, no, but she lived, though, so you're good. Like, damn. Uh, and you're right, you're right. Joey, what you said earlier about them over-explaining stuff, when she yeah. has the vision and goes back in time, and she's like, my mom was trying to... Like, like, you hear the mom talking to the doctor. It's like, your baby's disabled. And it's like, oh, she went to the Amazon to get spider powers to save the baby. And we got it. But I guess they thought the audience wouldn't get it. So Dakota Johnson goes, I don't have that disease. Oh, you were trying to save me, mom. And I'm in the theater talking to the Dune popcorn bucket going like, yeah, I already know. <laughs> yeah. Did they say the disease? Uh, they named it. Who knows what the disease is? So Ginger Vitus. So so her power <laughs> oh, Ian, you would have died. So her power is to see the future. <laughs> and then the magic spider Ginger Peru Vitus. guy goes, by the way, you have another power where you can split into six different people when it's convenient. I'm like, what the fuck is this power? I'm like, this doesn't make any goddamn sense. 
and then she gets hit in the face with a firework, and then she becomes Madam Web. Uh, here's after the thing. defeating the villain with the Pepsi sign. With the Pepsi <laughs> sign. The that's, how, that's how I want to die. I want to die. That was the S, right? I think it was the S. I think it was the S. He kept seeing the S, but the yeah. S was the thing that And he's like, him. oh, this is so refreshing. Oh, and then he dies. Yeah. Oh, and the whole see, reason he's trying to the kill movie, them. Apparently, I know the movie. Yeah. The whole reason he's trying to kill them is because the girls are going to kill him in the future, but then that doesn't happen. And it's like, all right, well, what was that vision? Um, I really yeah, that was what, this Tony, do you, it would have been kind of clever if she actually put that vision in his head the whole time, which mm. would lead him to his death. But that would yeah. be too much thought. Tony, yeah. zoom in a little bit. I can't yeah. zoom on this. All right, listen, listen. <laughs> I will say when I walked out of the theater, I am this, no different than a man. This movie is terrible. However, no, I didn't it's not. <laughs> I didn't hate it. I kind of enjoyed it. Oh uh, when it was okay, it was okay. When it was bad. <laughs> I found it like adorable. I think I met you before the stream. Like adorable? it's like when a kid like draws you a picture and it sucks and you're like, Oh, will you try? I can see how, why you thought that might be good. Um, it's not, but you know, points for trying. But yeah. should um, I watch this? You should. Cause I, I, Crystal. I still stand besides by it's the Crystal. boobs and the hotness. Besides that, besides Crystal. that, I will drool the whole time. Yes. Crystal. my love. Is yes, Dakota Johnson naked? Come over and watch it with me. No, no, oh. no. She's got like a thing. Trust me. Come over and I watch look. it with me. I got you, girl. <laughs> hey. Um, hey, what's yeah. up? Adam, Adam, <laughs> I need to ask you a question. <laughs> please, please do. This goes back to our first meeting. Were you at least happy to see Lucky from Ghostbusters Afterlife in the movie? You're a <laughs> lucky nut, right? You're excited <laughs> to see her in the next Sony movie, Ghostbusters Frozen Empire, right? You told me who Lucky is like five times. I still forgot. I, I, <laughs> I, feel, I feel like everyone who loved Ghostbusters Afterlife doesn't know who Lucky is. Well, I didn't love Ghostbusters Afterlife, so I have an excuse. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she gets frozen in the next movie because she was shooting this for Sony at the same time. Mm. So she oh might God. not even be in the next movie that much. Oh, either. I know. Okay, Lucky was the mom, right? No. No, she was the girl the brother was into. I still no idea then. No idea. <laughs> <laughs> um, Finny Finny's boobs with me. Jesus Christ, jo Johanna's in a tunnel. Uh, <laughs> Johanna went through a tunnel. 